Remember how she bought her first house on her own? Now, now she swiped, and how she swiped left and met Nathan. Right, was it? Oh, it must be the gay one you swiped left. Who presents this woman to be married to this man? <coughs> Somebody? <laughs> <laughs> we forgot that bit. <laughs> and who presents this man to be married to this woman? Thanks, no, no. Got a story to discover a new Nathan, aka Boy. Looking back to where it all started, a person who I only knew as a boy called Nathan with a dog in his profile picture. The one who didn't let me up, let up on messaging me. The one who was always on the other side of my phone for months. The one who caught my eye and who who took so much interest in me. Looking a little bit forward, you were the boy who walked as fast as I could run, the boy who was keen to catch up, and the boy who bought a TV so the girl didn't think he was weird. <laughs> but also the boy who I started to love extremely fast. You quickly became the most important person in my life. You were the most reliable, the most comforting, the most hardworking, the funniest, and the most everything. Shana, you make the world a better place. You're caring, Nate. You're making me cry, man. You make the world a better place with your caring nature, infectious laughs, silly jokes, random thoughts, random outbursts of song and dance, which are mainly in the shower. I now struggle to find words to describe you and what you mean to me. I'm literally lost when you're not around. You're always on my mind. You're always the first person I call with my random thoughts or indecisiveness, even though you don't like that. <laughs> the arms I feel the most safe and cosy in. You're exactly the man I grew up being told to find and not settle for anything less. Shana, you never understand how much your random texts or phone calls during the day help make any day that little bit better. Not just a discount, actually coming home and seeing you. But of course, Shana, I can't really thank you enough for showing me how to love, care, and what a genuine relationship should be like. I promise to always annoy you. I promise to always stop re-cleaning your cleaning. I promise to always be your edge lady. <laughs> but on a more serious note, I promise to stand beside you in the good and bad times. I promise to always be up for new adventures and support you any adventures you want to tackle. I will do everything I can to keep these four promises. But there is a fifth promise which I've broken. There is a fifth promise that I've broken many times, which is Shana's rule for Saturday work. <laughs> the rule is if we don't make more than 500 bucks, she That's is an interest. That's on a Saturday. <laughs> on a Saturday. I'm not interested. So yeah, sorry about that one. <laughs> Shana, you're an amazing person. You make Nate so happy. How special that your paths have crossed and we stand here today celebrating you both. I'd like to, for you all to raise a grass, sorry, glass. Um, <laughs> and take life on together. I promise to never stop loving you and I promise to love you and be by your side forever. Nathan, I've had the best time getting to know you and falling madly in love with you. I cannot wait to marry you today and become your wife. Shana, I love you with all my heart. I can't wait to spend this amazing day with you, friend, and see what our future holds together. 
The future is so exciting, so many more adventures and so much more of life's different milestones and crazy adventures to experience and I could not have imagined a more perfect person to experience this with. I love you so much.